According to the Al Arabi news channel, the agreement will be signed on October 20th in the area of Roshanikha on the border between the two countries. Well, Benita, we are after all just a few weeks away from elections here in Israel, so it's absolutely no surprise that we'll hear a statement like this from the opposition and from Benjamin Netanyahu in particular. It is interesting to see that he criticized it but did not say that he would cancel it or leave the deal um, at all. He's saying that he will deal with it as they have deal dealt with other uh, previous bad deals. But if you look at it from the perspective of the two governments, the two parties involved, they will see this as a success if it does go through. Earlier today, Lebanese President Michel Aoun was reported today saying a deal is days away and that the launch of the gas exploration marks the beginning of Lebanon's economic recovery. Lebanon and Israel are in negotiations over the oil and gas rich area of the Mediterranean Sea between both countries. Washington has acted as a negotiator between both sides to settle the dispute to demarcate the border. Psalm 83. Keep not thou silence, O God. Hold not thy peace. And be not still, O God.